Dear students, now we are going to solve one important problem in order statistics filter. Illustrate how order statistics filters remove salt and paper noise for the given image segment using zero padding and pixel replication. So in this problem they have given us 4 cross 4 image segment. Correct? 5, 0, 6, 8, 10, 200, 12, 11, 7, 9, 0, 255, 14, 12, 8, 13. So here they have given us salt and paper noise. What does it mean? So in this image segment, we can have two extremes. One is 0, another one is 255. So it is a gray level image, correct? So in this gray level image, 0 represents black and 255 represents what? White color. That is salt and pepper noise. Two extremes are present in this image. We are going to remove this salt and pepper noise using order statistics filters. Do you all understand this concept? So here they have given us to use both zero padding and pixel replication. So first we are going to solve the problem using median filter for zero padding concept. So zero padding means what? We are going to add two rows and two columns with a zero values around the given segment. So this is what the image segment given in the problem. Correct. So we are going to find out the median filter range only for this image segment. So we can consider the location of this image as 1 comma 1. That is the location of this first one. So here it is 1 comma 2. Here it is 1 comma 3. 1 comma 4. The location is very important. We are going to consider only within this segment. Okay. So here it is 2 comma 1, 2 comma 2, 2 comma 3, 2 comma 4. Likewise here it is 3 comma 1, 3 comma 2, 3 comma 4. Sorry, 3 comma 3, 3 comma 4. 4 comma 1, 4 comma 2, 4 comma 3 and 4 comma 4. So this are the spatial locations of the pixel values. Okay. So first we are going to take this first pixel value okay so 5 at position 1 comma 1 for this one we can take only this 3 cross 3 segment so here we can take 3 cross 3 median filter concept so here in the question if they haven't given us the proper size of that filter we can, we can assume that size is 3 cross 3 okay one. so here we can take this 3 cross 3 median filter okay within this segment we are going to apply the concept Median filter means what? In the given segment, we are going to find out the median value of this 5. So, we can take this neighboring pixels alone. So, in this segment, we are going to write down the ascending order with all the values. So, how many zeros are there? So, how many zeros are there? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. So, 6 zeros we need to write down. Okay, not only 1. All the terms should be written. Correct. So, next to highest value is 5 then 10, then 200. So here there are 9 values. So first 4 we can ignore, the last 4 we can ignore. What is the median value? The center 1 is 0. So the 5 can be replaced with the value 0 in the final answer. So next we can move on to the second position 0. At the time we can consider the next neighboring pixels. For this 0, what all are the neighboring pixels here? 1, 2, 3, 4 zeros next to 5 and then 6, 10, 12, 200. So here the median value is what? 5. So 0 can be replaced with that value 5. Likewise for this 6, okay. For this 6, the neighboring pixels are this box. So box is very important, okay. 3 by 3, the neighboring pixels. So 4 zeros, 6, 8, 11, 12, 200, ascending order. So we can get the center value is what? 6. Then for this 8, we can get the value is 0. Likewise, for each and every values, we can get the median value of each pixel. Okay. The same way, we can get the median value of this 11 at position 2, 4 as 6. Okay. The median value can be identified by using this median filter concept for each and every pixel of the given segment. Okay, zero padding is our consideration to preserve the values. Okay, do you all understand this one? So each value can be replaced with the respective 
median values okay do you all understand this one so after finding out the median values for each pixels finally you can write the median filter response for the given image segment so this is what the given image segment for that segment the median filter response is what 5 is replaced with that value 0 0 is replaced with the value 5 6 is replaced with the value 6 itself 8 is replaced with the value 0 so the same way 10 as 5 200 as 7 12 as 9 11 as 6 7 as 9 9 as 10 0 as 12 255 as 8 14 as 0, 12 as 7, 8 as 8, 13 as 0. From this, we can infer certain important concept here. So, 255, that is known as salt noise. Salt means white color. Correct. So, the salt noise can be replaced with the values which are similar to the given image segment. Correct. So, here we can reduce which noise? Salt noise. Do you all understand this one? So, if you are going to use zero padding, we can get the answer like this. But still, there is some pepper noise. Correct. Zero is present in this point due to that zero padding. That can be avoided by using pixel replication. So, if you are going to perform pixel replication, this pepper noise can also be removed. Okay. So next, we are going to perform the median filtering concept using pixel replication method. So, in this method, what we are going to do means, this is what the given image segment. Okay, so this is what the given image segment 5068, 10, 200, 12, 11, 790, 255, 14, 12, 8, 30. So, pixel replication means the top row can be replaced with the same value. So, 5068. The corner can be the same value as such. Okay, here it is 5. The same way. This side, it is 5, 10, 7, 14. Here it is 14. The bottom line, we can repeat the same row, 14, 12, 8, 13. The same way, the last row is 8, 11, 255, 13. The first and last rows, first and last columns can be replicated. Okay. So, that's what pixel replication method. By doing this method, we can remove both salt and pepper noise. Okay. So, here the same way we are going to consider only the given image segment from this point. So, here we can take this is 1, 1, 1, 2, 1, 3, 1, 4 the same procedure. Okay, we are going to start from this 1, 1 position. So, for this 5 we can take the 3 by 3 median filter concept. So, we are going to consider only the neighboring pixels. So, in this neighboring pixels how many zeros are there? 2 zeros. So, we can write 2 zeros and next four fives are there then two times and 200 so in this one what is that median value here it is five we can take that value as five for the second value zero so what all are the neighboring values here we can consider this three by three window okay for this zero we can take two zeros and then two fives two six ten twelve two hundred okay so what is that median value six so, 0 can be replaced with the value 6. Likewise, we can move on to that next, next, next value. So, next for this pixel, we can consider this neighboring pixel values. 2 zeros, 6, 2, 2 zeros, 2, 6, 2, 8, 11, 12, 200. So, what is that median value? 8. Do you all understand that concept? Likewise, we can get that value says 8 as 8, 10 as 7, 200 as 7, 12 as 9, 11 as 11, 7 as 10, right? 9 as 10, correct? Huh? So, 0 as 12, 255 as 12, 14 as 12, 12 as 12 as 9. Do you all understand this one? The same way we can get 8 as 12, 13 as 13. Correct. So, after getting the median values for all the pixel values given in the problem, finally we can write the output as the median filtered response of the given image segment using pixel replication. So, here 5 can be replaced with the value 5, 0 as 6. Correct. 6 as 8, 8 as 8, 10 as 7, 200 as 7, 12 as 9, 11 as 11, 7 as 10, 9 as 10, 0 as 12, 
255 as 12, 14 as 12, 12 as 9, 8 as 12, 13 as 13. So you can see that this pepper noise as well as salt noise all cleared by using this median filter concept. Okay, so what is the inference from this median filter? So median filter with pixel replication suppresses the salt and pepper noise in an efficient